Hey friends, happy Go Figure Friday. Today it is a blast from the past of sorts as I am talking about muscle and that is millions of unusual small creatures lurking everywhere. Now I remember these from the 80s and they were just generic wrestlers. They were many different shapes. They originated in Japan and more than 230 of them were made here in the United States. I think they were based on a cartoon, an anime series in Japan, by the way. Uh, I remember getting a few as a child, as a probably tween slash uh, teenager. Uh, unfortunately, though, I don't think I saved any of them because I can't find any from my collection. They were very small, though, very easy to lose, um, and very kind of basic looking. Their, their skin tone, there's not uh, any color or any pizzazz to them, uh, but I have three. Uh, there are actually four in the series. Uh, of the Legend series. I have here uh, Mean Gene Okerlund, the Iron Sheik, and Ric Flair, which I will be opening in just a moment. I have the Junkyard Dog, Jake the Snake Roberts, and the Ultimate Warrior. And I have uh, Rowdy, Rowdy Piper, Andre the Giant, and the Macho Man Randy Savage. Now, these two, since I'm opening this one to show you guys a closer look, these two are going to be uh, one pack is going to go to the annual Stride Pro Wrestling My One Two Three Cents Pro Wrestling Action Figure Toy Drive, which I'm very excited about doing for a second year, hoping to top uh, and get hundreds of toys this year, wrestling action figures to donate uh, to Toys for Tots. The other one is going to go to one of you. What I need you to do, what I want you to do is go on to wherever you listen to podcasts, listen to the My One Two Three Cents podcast first, and then review it. You can give it a one star, you can give it a five star, you can say it sucks, you can say it's great. Everyone who reviews, screenshots it, and sends it to me on the My123Cents Facebook page will be entered in to win. I'll draw, and then I will get your information and send you one of these packs, and I'll let you pick which pack you get. So it's either going to be Piper Andre Savage or Junkyard Dog, Jake the Snake, and Ultimate Warrior. There is also Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase, Sergeant Slaughter, and I've already forgotten the other superstar who was a part of that. Hacksaw Jim Duggan. So there's Duggan, Slaughter, and DiBiase in another pack, which is not available. These are three bucks, by the way. So a pretty good find for sure. You can buy them for all four for 20 bucks. So you pay a little bit more. Uh, so anyway, since I am uh, a big Nature Boy fan, uh, I figured I would open that one and add these little guys to my collection behind me. And as I said, they are very small. They're Sheiky Baby. These seem a little bit more, and these are by Mattel too, by the way. Um, these seem a little bit, and Sheik doesn't want to stand up. Here's Ric Flair. Woo! Nature Boy. And then, last but not least, the late, great, mean Gene Okerlund. So, um, they don't stand very well, or at least not on this surface. Oh, there goes Nature Boy. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. These guys are, I, I remember the ones from childhood being a little more bendable, I guess. These aren't as uh, flexible, which is fine. I mean, I'm going to put them on display. I'm not going to be wrestling with them. Uh, so I'm going to add them to the collection. Sheik's boots aren't uh, curled on the toes, but that's okay too. Uh, but yeah, again, if you want to enter to win, it's easy to do. Head on over, review the My One Two Three Cents podcast, screenshot the review, and then send it to me via the My One Two Three Cents Facebook page. Everyone, thanks so much for tuning in to this week's episode. We'll talk again soon.